to Jim Lang and the Dating Game. Thank you very much, Johnny. And by the way, if you're over 18, you're single, and you live in the Southern California area, you're lucky. And you'd like to audition to be a contestant on the dating game? Great. Just call us. Area code 213-467-9136. That's any Monday through Friday between 10 and 7. The number again, 467-9136. And now, it's time to meet our next three eligible bachelors for game number two. And here they are. Good luck, bachelors. Bachelor number one is an experimental cook and a map collector who's won physical fitness awards and trophies. He loves sports, theater, and acting. He is Brian Cranston. Brian, welcome. <laughs> Bachelor number two is a bartender who just likes to fool around and see what happens. And that's probably why he's here. He's looking for a girl who can laugh at herself and it figures that he's from Chicago. Say hello to Michael Sternbauer. <laughs> Bachelor number three is a store manager and a suspender collector, believe it or not. He's been given the worst skateboard rider award, and he loves to go to the movies. He is Jim Brown. Jim? And those are our bachelors all set for game number two. It's time now to meet our young lady for game number two. She's standing by, and here she is. This enchanting young lady rode and showed Tennessee quarter horse for eight years, with numerous awards. The stewardess loved to roller skate and travel. Here is the vivacious Marilyn Staley. Hello, Marilyn. Welcome to the dating game. We have a date for you. Actually, we have three possible dates for you. You ask the questions and select the one you think you'd like the best, all right? Okay. And I'm sure they would all be happy. First of all, we're going to have them say hello. Number one, would you please say hello to Marilyn? Hello, Marilyn. Numero uno here. <laughs> okay. How about number two? How you doing, Marilyn? And bachelor number three. How are you, Marilyn? Okay, they're ready to go. I think you'd loosen them up a little bit? Try. All right, have a seat. Make yourself comfortable. Good luck, bachelors. And we'll get the microphone set, and here we go. Good luck. Okay, guys, are you ready? Sure, yeah. I'm ready. Okay, bachelor number one. I was on the dating game when I was 18. What do you hope I've learned about bachelors since then? Well, I hope that you've learned that they're not all bad. <laughs> actually, actually, we're a good group of guys. Uh, I was just talking to a couple in the back and uh, uh, quite a few occupations going around, different, different kinds of occupations that I think you'd be interested in. I think number one would be your most uh, important decision would be to pick number one. I think so. Okay. Thank you, bachelor number one. Bachelor number two. What do you like to do to your bed before you go to sleep at night? Occupy it with some, you know, music or um, person or... As long as it's neat and clean, it'll be all right. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I like that. Okay, number three. I like going to the movies. Tell me about the home movie that you're going to show me that you starred in. Oh, that's simple. We make them all the time. I love to go to the movies, too. It's about uh, an adventurer who, uh, who likes to climb mountains and, uh, and uh, discover all different new things that he's not uh, aware of as of yet. <laughs> <laughs> and... <laughs> You really got her with that one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. There'll be plenty of popcorn. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks. Bachelor number two. What unsuccessful attempts at clothing did Adam and Eve make before they discovered fig leaves? Well, they, they tried animals, but they kept crawling away. <laughs> <laughs> Terrific answer. What kind of animals? Uh, snakes. Snakes? Squirrels. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Okay. Number one. Yes. How do you know when you've been a bachelor too long? One here. Ah, uh, yes. When you, when you find yourself uh, doing your own laundry and the dishes and having to iron your own clothes, it's, it's time to give it up. 
<laughs> Get married. Get married. Oh, time's up, Marilyn. Now you have to make up your mind, so think about what you heard and then come up with a decision, all right? Marilyn will tell us which one of our bachelors she found most fascinating and get her date. And we return right after these words. Don't go away. Hurry, don't miss the last five hours of Levitt's giant pre-inventory sale. That's right, tomorrow from 5 p.m. to 10 p.m. is the last five hours of this sensational sale. Save 10 to 57% off on selected items, all first quality famous name brand furniture. We must make room, and frankly, Levitt's would rather sell furniture than count it. Imagine, you save 10 to 57% off on selected items. That's tomorrow from 5 p.m. to 10 p.m., the last five hours of Levitt's pre-inventory sale. Don't miss it. Love it at Levitt's. The most exciting racing in the West is this weekend's NHRA Winter Nationals Drag Races at the Fairgrounds in Pomona. The fastest racing in the West, the 250-mile-an-hour Winter Nationals. The richest racing in the West, the $400,000 Winter Nationals. For 20 years, not a major star in the sport has missed this season opener, 600 of the best. Qualifying until 5.30 p.m. Wednesday through Saturday, final Sunday, 11 a.m. Save $3 now with advanced tickets at Ticketron outlets everywhere. The Winter Nationals this weekend, Pomona. Saturday at 8, the past returns with terror when Gregory Peck and Robert Mitchum star in Cape Fear. Say, she's getting to be, uh, getting to be almost as juicy as your wife, ain't she? Eight years ago, I was a witness against a man, and he was sent to prison. A type like that is an animal. Don't miss dramatic suspense with Cape Fear on the Channel 5 Movie Theater, Saturday at 8. Sunday on Channel 5, Pirates and Scoundrels Beware, cause Pippi's back. Now, what have you got to say to me? The freckle-faced heroine of the famous children's books is on her way to another fantastic, magical adventure in Pippi and the South Seas. Inside my papa's house Until he comes back home From tomorrow's <laughs> Pippi captures the hearts of the whole family in Pippi and the South Seas, Sunday at 6 on Channel 5. Our dating game runners up for game two will receive polyglycode to sound shield protection. Insist upon your certificate of application from new car dealers only. Not an undercoating, polyglycode is a sound shield. Plus, Sepacol, a pleasant tasting and refreshing mouthwash that's used more by hospitals and all other brands combined. Sepacol. Plus, moisturize dry skin while you bathe with Capri emollient bath oil. Capri puts back the natural oils and moisture dry skin can't afford to lose. Plus, put a shower in your toilet bowl with new Be Fresh. Helps white bowl ring buildup makes every flush a deodorizing shower. Now back to Jim Lang. Thank you very much, Johnny. All right, Marilyn, we have reached that magic moment of truth. Now, you're going to have to tell us which one of those bachelors impressed you the most. They were all very good, but only one will get the date. Will it be bachelor number one, bachelor number two, or bachelor number three? Who is it? They're all great, but number two. Number two. He's got his own fan club, I think. Any particular reason? I just like the way he answered the questions. You just like overall his answers. Okay, I'll tell you what. Before you meet him, we're going to keep you in suspense just a little bit and introduce you to the other bachelors and see what you missed. You didn't choose bachelor number one. He is an experimental cook. He has uh, won fitness awards, loves theater and acting. His name is Brian Cranston. Brian, come on and say hello, please, to Marilyn. Shake your hand to stop it from trembling there, Brian. And you also didn't choose bachelor number three, Marilyn. He is a manager right now. He mentioned he loves the movies. Uh, he loves the skateboard. His name is Jim Brown. Jim, come on and say hi, please. Well, guys, even though you weren't selected, I can say you did a great job. Win the uh, Dating Game Love Award for doing a super job. We have gifts for both of you. Maybe you can come back again. All right, thanks a lot. Thank you. Now, Marilyn, are you ready? Ready to fall in love? All right, all right, all right. Let me tell you something about bachelor number two. At the moment, he's a bartender, but he's a wild and crazy guy. He'll do anything. Originally from Chicago, say hello to your date, Michael Sternbauer. Michael 
Congratulations, Michael. You did the right thing. Well, Michael and Marilyn, to start things off, each of you will receive a selection of Substance II vitamins and minerals. There. I don't think either of you need it too much, but they're, especially you, Marilyn, they're available in convenient family-sized bottles and the new Take Em Anywhere packets. Substance II vitamins are timed release, an easy way to get 21 essential vitamins and minerals. That's Substance II from VitaFresh. And you're going to need them, really. You're going to need that extra energy when we send you to the seat of our democracy, Washington, D.C. That's right. Our nation's historic and very beautiful capital city, complete with those ever-famous, always magnificent cherry blossoms. In Washington, you'll stay at the Quality Inn Capitol Hill, just two blocks from the Capitol building, and near all the famous landmarks along the mall. Quality Inn's the most comfortable place under the sun all across the U.S., Canada, and sunny Mexico. Then, as you tour this great city filled with our American heritage, you might want to take a moment and create a few romantic and historic fireworks of your own. In any case, I know you will love Washington, D.C. Thank you very, very much. You make an e-couple, you know that? You really do. Come on over here, Marilyn, Mike. Well, everything all right? I won't say it. We gotta go, bye-bye. Ready to throw a kiss? Everybody, here we go. Summer are coming to be sobered by America, the extra service car rental that gives you the executive treatment features Ford and other fine cars. Tomorrow night, catch the UCLA basketball action as the Bruins battle the Oregon State Beavers. Sports excitement coming your way tomorrow night at 9, right after Prisoner Cell Block H. Next, Rod Serling waits to guide you into the Twilight Zone. Stay tuned to Channel 5. The Dating Game is a Chuck Paris production.